Greetings, YouTubers. I um, ordered a lot of a lot of bits um, from eBay and stuff over the last weeks and months. And instead of showing off every little order, I thought I uh, collect all together and present it to you as one video. Um, you may recognize this Games Workshop Terran without the trees. I'm going to fill that up here with a modeling putty and um, some other rubble to make a large area of difficult terrain. That's a box from some old G.I. Joe toy. It has some nice ammunition in there. As you can see, a lot of, a lot of rockets and pretty large. I mean, here's a Space Marine torso. Um, however, maybe for, a, I don't know, a Manticore or whatever. So. I was thought we're not taking it. Yeah. Imperial Guard Fortwood Chimera Rear Door from Urban War. Wo from the company Void. Or Void or whatever. Character, special character named Brennus. I don't know if you can see that. He looks pretty nicely detailed and would I'm sure he would make a good rebel leader or cultist leader or whatever. Some schools. For chaos, uh, and probably going to put them on a chaos land radar one day, or might be nice. It's Imperial Guard stuff, uh, probably later. Fortwood Ultramarine Rhino front plate and doors. Just, actually, it belongs here. Just some minor stuff from the Black Templars. A special backpack, uh, which has a little candle in there. Good for for a um, chaplain, I believe. A lot of larger um, purity seals. I'm not sure where they are from. Some of our pergament, which will be hanging down from my vehicles from the sides. Same with these. Uh, don't know. Don't know what they're called in English. Weihrauch behälter, Weihrauchfässer, whatever. Oh yeah, these are cool. Forty world. Red Scorpion um, jump packs. They have nice Imperial Aquila modeled on. So I'm going to use one for my captain, and that's probably more than I'm going to use anyway. Captain and Sergeant of the Assault Squads. Let's see. Fort World Red Scorpion shoulder pads. I'm going to dremel out the um, Red Scorp the Scorpion, but leave the circle and paint an ultramarine logo in there and probably issue these to my sergeants or veterans or whatever. These are really cool. The Red Scorpion um, torso pieces. I've got the Scorpion in the circle in the middle too. Should be no problem to dremel that out and there's some nice looking torsos. Nice here from the again Red Scorpion but the same, they are, they are so Vanguard veterans, they've got some nice detail molded on. That's just some different retinue, um, probably for an Inquisitor. Fort World with a power sword and bolt pistols. Additional Terminator details. A lot of close combat weapons, power weapons. That's from the Dark Angel upgrade set, but I like the different look of this, like the small baggonet he has there. And I'm fighting off all the Dark Angel insignia and probably be using this for my Terminator Sergeant. Again, spare power fists, old power axes, more detail here. These helmets are cool, too bad I don't, I hope have only two of these. Fort World, uh, Red Scorpion, I believe these are Mark V Maximus helmets, I'm not sure, old stuff, but looks pretty cool. Veteran Sergeant Cohen, got three heads, I'm going to use one like this, on another one I'm going to file his haircut off, so he's bald, and I'm going to change the appearance a little bit. Lots of, of these, from Devastator Sergeant, the uh, pointing chainsaws, all sorts from the old Death Watch kill team, the um, heads from Devastator, Sergeant, plasma pistol and bolt gun from the Spaceman Captain, this one too. 
here's some more Dark Angel stuff where I'm going to file the insignia off. And since I'm going to re magnetize a lot of my Space Marines, oops, like those who can wear different equipment, like the, the sergeants, and um, just think about the command squad of the captain, which can entirely be, except for the apothecary, equipped with anything, with power swords, power fists, bolt pistols, plasma pistols. That's why I need a lot of spare pieces, spare parts, to make it exchangeable. And um, yeah, along with my um, with the stuff that I already have here, that's quite a sizable collection of bits and should allow me some serious customization. Or just got the heads in here, torsos, backpacks and I'm oh, sorry I'm shaking here. Backpacks and banners, left arms, right arms, purity seals and all these pergament pieces that you can put on space marine armor, bolt guns and bolt pistols, pouches and grenades, knives, scopes and auspexes, aus shoulder pads. Um, left-handed shooting weapons and uh, even some without without an arm shooting weapons with a right hand left hand close combat weapons right hand close combat weapons so I, I kind of sorted it this way I've got another I think a better way of storing these a much larger box where you can actually have little um, shoot figure you can pull out. It's difficult if you if you're looking for a certain hat. We either have to dig around here or try to get them out, put them on the table, and sort it out. But by trying to get these out, they fall in the other compartments here. That's not not so good. The other thing that I, as I said, you put it out, and you can search in there. So yeah, bits, 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 and. Um, that should allow me some serious conversations, customization. Uh, I really like these. These are pretty cool. So, yeah. Um, that's it for this video of Superman. Signing out.